66 million years ago, dinosaurs and all life forms living on Earth had a terrible day that would go down in the annals of history as one of the deadliest days ever. On the fatal day, a giant asteroid measuring between 10.6 kilometers to 80.9 kilometers across slammed into the oceans offshore of Yucatan Peninsula near Texcoc in Mexico. The Tix Club impact triggered a major extinction brain, known as Cretaceous Mass Extinct Event, that wiped out over three quarters of the 75% of land and sea species. Famous for potentially being the cause of dinosaurs' extinctions, the scientists still know less about what happened on the last day of dinosaurs. But now we have a better idea of how dinos met their demise. The paleontologists is known for more about the remote consequence of asteroid strike documented in the fossil records than a few hours following the impact. However, an international team of more than two dozen scientists led by the researchers from the University of Texas at Austin has found hard evidence in the hundreds of feet of rocks that filled the impact crater within the first 24 hours after the impact. The geologist had to drill into the rock 500 to 1300 meters below the Six Club crater's ground zero. To find core samples of charcoal, melted rock, and curious absence of sulfur in the cores. The work started in 2016 with the International Ocean Discovery Program scientific drilling missions that aimed to extract the rocks from the Six Club impact site. Saint Golak a research professor at the University of Texas Institute of for Geophysics led the present study and goal of the International Ocean Discovery Program. It's an expanded record of events that we were able to recover from within the ground zero, said Gulag. It tells us about the impact pressure from an eyewitness location. The impact after the mighty and the blinding fireball appeared in the sky triggered a chain of massive tsunamis and wildfires. So much sulfur was released into the atmosphere that it eclipsed the sun. A global cooling ensued and that ultimately doomed the dinosaurs. This work also builds on the previous research effort to call it by the UT's Jackson School of Geoscience, describing the crater's formations and how life recovered rapidly at the impact site. If it is often uh, consolations, the last day of the dinosaurs may have been a bit shorter than Today's 24 hours day, a few hours shorter. That's because in addition to the moon's action, the Earth was still tuning its spinning velocity during the dinosaur's age in Mesozoic era, from 250 million to 65 million years ago. The last day of the dinosaurs were probably between 21 and 23 hours. Not all dinosaurs perished that day. Although they all died within few months after the strike, the large dinos world was dark and cold, with food getting more and more scarce. All that said, maybe humans couldn't even have had the chance of our eyes if it wasn't for this asteroid impact. After the dinosaurs were out of picture, it was time for mammals and the flowering plants to reign over the earth.